going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Today's video is about Xbox One and Xbox Project Scorpio and the future of the console when it comes to the Japanese market. Now we all know the Xbox and the Xbox brand in particular hasn't been very popular in Japan or with Japanese games, namely Japanese exclusives. On the other side of the coin is PlayStation, seeing games that are developed by Japan Studios and many exclusive Japanese titles coming to the console. Will this change at any time in the future? Probably not, but Xbox head Phil Spencer believes that there is something in the pipeline that could change this paradigm. I'll drop a link in the description. Xbox chief Phil Spencer says Japanese games are coming to Xbox One and Project Scorpio. Project Scorpio is a rare game console because we know quite a bit about the device before its launch. Sure, plenty is shrouded in mystery, but Microsoft has also been open about its native 4K capable console. Xbox head Phil Spencer has recently been in Japan, where he discussed J where he discussed Japanese specific games for the Xbox One and Project Scorpio. As you may know, Spencer is an expert at giving some information while not really saying much. This is the case again. The Xbox One executive simply replied to a tweet saying that Japanese developers are interested in the platform. Spencer adds that he tested quote a lot end quote of new titles that will be coming to Xbox One and Project Scorpio. However, he did not expand on which developers he met and what specific games we can expect to see. Japan has been something of an unconquerable market to Microsoft. Xbox has always been second best to PlayStation in terms of sales. This is even true for the seventh generation. Both the Xbox 360 and PS3 sold similar numbers globally, but in Japan, Sony's console far outsold Microsoft's. Of course, both Sony and Nintendo are Japanese companies. There are other reasons why Japan is cool in the Xbox brand. For example, the country is notable for having an internal games industry where many titles don't leave the country or Southeast Asia region. Microsoft has struggled to secure partnerships with major Japanese developers. There is a lack of noted Japan-based franchises on the Xbox One. Things are slowly changing, however, and Spencer's claims suggest Microsoft is making headway in the country. Project Scorpio may help further growth in Japan. It will be the only 4K providing console, which could be important in a country that values tech advancements. Well, it's always good, and, and I've said this many times before, the, the thing that Microsoft needs more so than anything else is exclusives. Now, if they're J Japanese games or Japan exclusives or games that are centered toward the Japanese audience, that's, that's fine. I think that those games have a huge audience, myself included, and Microsoft definitely needs to have some in their repertoire of games. I don't know if having more power on the other hand is going to make the Xbox a more attractive console in Japan. The Japanese culture just seems to resist the Western idea of what game consoles and game companies should be. Western imperialism, they don't seem to really dig that. And I mean, I would love to see the Xbox brand do well worldwide. I'd love to see them do really well in Japan. And, and the only way they're gonna actually be able to do that is by accepting the Japanese culture, creating games around that culture, games that matter to the people of that land, and watching it blossom like a flower. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think we can expect to see some meaningful Japanese games coming to the Xbox One and Project Scorpio, hopefully in the near future? Let me know what you think in the comments. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can share your videos and support the channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.